to MS Welding TV. Today I want to talk about a job that I recently did involving a Chinese CNC plasma machine which I, I wouldn't normally touch but in this instance and in this situation was a little bit different and me carrying out a retrofit with a Hypertherm Powermax 85 and getting some pretty phenomenal results. It all started with an email which went a little bit something like this. Dear sirs, we currently have a CNC plasma of Chinese origin. Recently, although the machine has seen us and served us well, the power source of the plasma seemed to emit lots of smoke and a loud bang and start to continuously blow the mains fuse. Please see the attached picture. Could you please advise on the cost of repair of the current plasma cutter or could you please advise on a retrofit and an upgrade to our current machine? So we went along to the customers, we carried out a site visit, we had a look at the CNC profiler machine, we had a look at how it was all coupled together and surprisingly enough it was actually built to quite a good standard, a very high spec, it had its own software built in, the motion control was quite accurate, it had its own designated height controller, so we thought in this instance what we'd do is show them our demo Powermax 85, turn it down to 45 amps, do a little bit of cutting and turn it up to 85 amps and do some cutting and let the customer decide on the cut capability of what they wanted and what we could achieve with both machines uh, and, and we took it from there. The customer decided to go for a Powermax 85 purely because of the cut capability, speed and that pierce of 90 millimeters where the Powermax 45 XP has got that 12 millimeter pierce and although the customer's only cutting 8 and 10 mil it's better to be on top than underneath or just on the borderline of what you're wanting to be doing. Have a look at the video, this is what went on, dead short and quick. Thanks for watching, please like and subscribe. This is MS Welding TV. Camera and you say it's the moment of truth.